hi hello this is anup here and in this video we are going to see how to upgrade uh, your secondary server to the latest version of configuration manager that is 20 2103 so in the previous video you have you might have already seen how to upgrade the primary server to the latest version of configuration manager that, that is 2103 right so i will link that I will put the link of that video primary server upgrade video into this videos description okay so let's get into it first of all you need to make sure that all the prerequisites are in place so all the details are available in the blog post um, and the link for the blog post is also available in the description of the video okay so I'm not going to go through all the prerequisites of um, secondary server upgrade, etc, etc, right? Um, so let's go to administration and sites, site configuration and sites, right? Sites, within sites, you would be able to see secondary server and right click on the secondary server and you can do upgrade from here. Otherwise, you just click on this and from the ribbon menu you can click on upgrade button right so this is the option you will get once uh, you start the upgrade right uh, it says you have chosen to upgrade secondary server secondary site h0 hs0 this action will upgrade database and server components on the server secondary server and will uninstall and reinstall the site roles and so that means uh, management point distribution point so those roles will be uninstalled and reinstalled right okay do you want to continue yes now you would be able to see the state is changed from site active to upgrade we'll come back to that in a minute or so I'll pause the video and come back you can click on a secondary site server and show install status that will give you some updates about what is happening over there right so you can see what has happened the prerequisite checks completed right and uh, you can see everything is okay now let's wait for another uh, probably 10 15 minutes and uh, we'll pause the video and come back you can also check uh, the log files at the secondary server uh, end on the secondary server okay there are logs like um, config Config MGR setup.log, SMS TSVC.log, and SMS bootstrap.log. These are the logs you can look into, right? If you want to check the status, if I open up these logs, you would be able to see their details. What is the exact process going on? Okay. Okay it is it is doing some sql upgrade at the moment or sql sql changes are going on and if i go back to the status page over here and see what is happening it is have it is upgrading the configuration manager database right copying the files to the directory oh, from the temp folder it's copying it to the program files microsoft configuration manager cmu client etc etc right so let's check the status again from the console show install status and it says transferring configuration manager files the database up is upgraded successfully that's good now let's wait and see how it goes okay so that means the site server installation successfully completed right 
let's refresh see successfully completed secondary site server installation successfully completed let's check the log file and let's go down a bit and it says same thing send message 002 to parent that means the the installation or upgrade got successfully completed now let's try click on ok and try to run a query to confirm okay let's select the correct database execute it it seems one one means the update is successfully completed right okay now let's go back to console fully console will get opened up now let's give a refresh and the secondary server build number should be 9049 refresh okay that's it 9049 so that means the secondary server got successfully upgraded to 2103 version of configuration manager so we have primary server and secondary server on the same build number right and version number that was a quick video about secondary server upgrade to 2103 thank you all for watching see you next time bye bye